602 this morning in a developing story. Police identified the suspects accused of killing four people and injuring five others during a shooting inside a KCK bar. One suspect is in police custody. The other is still at large this morning. According to a KCK police, 29 year old Hugo Villanueva Morales should be considered armed and dangerous. If you have seen him, contact police. 23 year old Javier Alatore was taken into custody on Sunday afternoon. Both suspects charged with four counts of first degree murder. So this morning, let's get to 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan joining us with the timeline of the investigation here. Charlie. Lindsay, this tragedy happened here at Tequila KC, the bar behind me, and is right near 10th and Central in KCK. Police say they were called here around 1130 on Saturday night to investigate some sort of argument. But when police got here, they couldn't find anyone who was involved in that argument, so they left. And then it was right before 1.30 early Sunday morning when police got the call to come back here to Tequila KC for this shooting. And the police department has told us that the two, that argument two hours earlier is what led to the shooting here early Sunday morning. At about 3.40 Sunday afternoon, police released pictures of their suspects, who we now know as Hugo Villanueva Morales and Javier Alatore. Police department said that both of these men had handguns when they left the bar after the shooting early Sunday morning. We do know police have since arrested Alatore, but Villanueva Morales is still on the loose and police are considering him armed and dangerous. Now, as police continue this investigation, the friends and family of these victims are left to pick up the pieces of what's left. And part of that process included holding a vigil here at the bar late last night. We talked to one woman who said that one of the, the victims here who died in the shooting, Evervado Meza, actually pushed her out of harm's way. I saw the gun go off and then I'm just on the floor and I'm like crawling and I'm like and I like look back as I'm on the floor and there's a man next to me and he's just like covered in blood and I'm like, oh my God, oh my God. I'm so we'll be hearing, of course, more stories like that as this investigation unfolds. And at that vigil last night, we learned th the names of three of the four men who died in this uh, shooting yesterday. We told you about Evervado Meza, who helped save that woman. There was also Alfredo Calderon and Francisco Garcia Anaya. Now, friends and family will also be hosting another uh, vigil of sorts. They're calling it a peace walk tonight at 7 o'clock. It begin, begins on 13th Street and then ends here at 10th and Central in front of Tequila KC. Reporting live in Kansas City, Kansas, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today.